Egypt farmer Faisal Mohammad Mursi has died while standing trial. Mursi was overthrown by the military in July 2013 following mass protests a year after he took office as the country's first democratically elected leader. How did he end up in court? What was Mursi convicted of? What did Mursi say about the trials and why he was buried hurriedly? These are our inside stories. Stay with us. Me, Fire and Ajim, and your host from your favorite channel, Aisyam, joined by my dad, Amrul Islam, and my adorable little sister, Salome. Hello and welcome, everybody. So, let me start with you, Salwa. Uh, how did Mursi end up in court? Well, Mursi came to power after Hosni Mubarak was deposed in the 2011 Arab Spring, after which the Muslim Brotherhood legalized with Mursi as its preferred candidate, winning the 2012 presidential election. Dr. Mohammed Mohammed Mursi, 13,230,131. That's 51% of the vote. Then there was jubilation as hundreds of thousands realized their candidate had become Egypt's first democratically elected president. He was however overthrown by the military within a year following a spate of mass protests against his rule. Actually, the then US President Barack Obama and Western countries supported the military coup because Mursi was an Islamic president. Salwa, uh, as we know, a death sentence handed to the 67-year-old president was crushed by an appeals court in 2016. But he remained in prison because of conviction of several charges. He was facing also retrials in two cases. So, Dad, what did Mursi say about the trial? Uh, well, you know, actually, Mursi rejected the authority of the courts. At the start of the at the start of his first trial in November 2013, he shouted from the dock that uh, he was the victim of a uh, military coup. He asserted that uh, he was Egypt's legitimate president, and the court had no right. Uh, to conduct any uh, to conduct any trial into presidential matters right uh, actually the trials were politically motivated and attempts to give legal cover to a coup human rights activists have said the trials were compromised by due process violations the appearance of bias and absence of conclusive evidence so what else Salwa? Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan has claimed that former Egyptian President Mr. Morsi didn't die. He was murdered. Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan paid tribute to Morsi while also condemning President al-Sisi. May Allah rest our brother Morsi, our martyr's soul in peace. As you know, the tyrant Sisi, who took power in Egypt, by suppressing democracy through a coup, has so far executed nearly 50 Egyptians. And Mursi's family and activists had repeatedly raised concerns about his health and the amount of time he was kept in solitary confinement away from visitors and lawyers and family, even after his health rapidly, uh, rapidly deteriorated. This is what told about the world and where Mursi has been placed. It was designed so that those who go in don't come out again unless dead. It was designed for political prisoners. This is where Egypt's first democratically elected president, Mohamed Morsi, spent the last six years of his life. The notorious Scorpion Prison. It has been described as a tomb for political prisoners in Egypt and denounced by human rights groups for its inhumane conditions and torture tactics. Thanks both of you. It speaks volumes of the continued cruelty as well as insecurity of the LCC regime that it forced Mr. Mursi's family to bury him under heavy security at a Cairo cemetery rather than at the family cemetery in the province of Sharkia. If the death sentence against Mr. Mursi in 2015 was overturned because the regime didn't want to make a martyr of him, but its cruelty has guaranteed that is exactly what he will become. Thanks for watching.